All right, Shalom, Shalom. First and foremost, um, giving our honor, praises, and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shah, Bahashem, Rechah, Gwadash, double honor to the apostles, the elders of Great Millstone who rule well, and a uh, peace, love, salutations, and blessings to the Lord's elect. It's the brother Yeshaya, part of Men of Valor, South Carolina. And um, this is going to be a quick lesson, um, you know, just going through and refreshing my YouTube feed. And um, I stumbled uh, um, across this video. Uh, at Wash 785, uh, um, basically at G22 Ministries 3. Um, that's the, um, you know, let's see. Yeah, that's the handle right there. Um, G22 Old Ministries or G220 Ministries. But uh, I saw this. It says, trying to reason with GMS Cleveland Israelites. I saw, um, you know, a little bit of it. Um, you know, you see one video like this, you've seen them all. But, you know, um, something told me to look at the comments. And uh, one stood out. It said, uh, from this guy right here, Walsh785, GMS is the sloppiest of one West. They're probably the least consistent. <laughs> and I was like, wow. On the contrary, actually, the most consistent and the one, uh, the only group you know, which uh, myself, uh, I can, I am uh, consider myself in, um, a, you know, under the umbrella of GMS through the spirit. Okay. We teach the same things through the spirit, man. All right. But yeah, man. Oh, then, um, yeah, this was a year ago. So it says GMS is the sloppiest of one West groups. They're probably the least consistent. I was read it. It says they'd probably say though that they are the most consistent thinking uh, they are under the true apostle Great Millstone. And, you know, um, I guess he's uh, kind of hinting to, um, you know, uh, Elder Pastor, you know, uh, the grape doctrine. There it is. Uh, and, you know, um, and that's the spirit because um, Elder Apostle Ramlob just did a video, you know, um, uh, breaking down, uh, uh, is it uh, Deuteronomy 22? Okay. About, you know, um, because the scriptures are set up that if it does happen, yeah, see, people are so sensitive. It happens. Uh, taking hold of a woman and taking it, so to say, it happens every day. OK, but there are laws that, you know, um, for offenses that are not punishable by death. And hey, you got to take it out with the Lord. But a uh, grape in most cases are not is not uh, punishable by death. So there's ways to handle it once it happens. But um, yeah. Um, here it is. The grape doctrine really hurt their rep, though. Who's worried about a rep? Okay, nobody's worried about a rep. Only rep that we are worried about is the uh, if Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shah is, is uh, pleased. Okay, uh, we don't give a damn about these uh, the rest of these groups, man. I've seen them trying to bounce back ever since. What happened to Tahar? Is he still around? Yeah, okay. Now, this is, as far as I know, they are, but many of their channels got shut down. And that's how you know that is the truth because, hey, brothers, channels get shut down all the time. All right, but hey, GMS is still pushing, you know, still around under different channel names, but it has seemed like they have decided to lay low. Hmm. Uh, I was, I know I was told by the SOZ who claimed to follow GMS that they were taking, they weren't taking in any more camps. So they follow GMS, but aren't officially. GMS. So yeah, you know, but um you could just type in GMS. I search GMS. So let's see if GMS is still around and what about Apostle Sahar? Let's see. Type in GMS look up. Oh. <laughs> hey, uh Elder Zakba, you know, bam. Um, you know, one of the most consistent teachers. This is three weeks ago, but he goes live almost every day and he's uh uploading videos every day. So how about that for consistency, right? Uh oh, speaking of uh Elder Apostle Har. Uh, his channel right here, GMS declaring the end. Hey, he just went in yesterday on MOTB. I got to finish watching the rest of them. You know, it's so hard to get these videos on. Uh, you want to, you know, especially with being a Jake and one track mind, you know, and getting, uh, you know, um, can't concentrate, you know. Yeah, but anyway, I'm, I'm finished watching that Lord's will. But he just, um, you know, very edifying as always. Okay. Talking about the MOTB. Now, let's see. Uh, look, uh, GMS overdrive 28 um, minutes ago. Look, GMS Germany is live right now. So, yes, GMS is still alive. The brother GMS uh, overdrive 144. Virgin Islands straight gate uh, live right now. So, come on, man. Um, the elder uh, in North Carolina, GMS North Carolina 777. Bam, three hours ago. You know, elder Monatis out by once again. Okay, so, yeah. So, that answers that question, you know. 
Hey, um, <laughs> Elder Pastor Har is still around. Uh, GMS is still around. And the brother Amawan Gabar, okay? You know, just stream live 16 hours. Come on, man. The most consistent group. So, there you go, man. So, that answers that question. Um, G220 Ministries or whatever. But anyway, um, I got a couple scriptures and I'm going to wrap this up. I didn't make, I didn't, uh, it tended to be that long, but you know. Matthew 7 and 16. Uh, ye shall know them by their fruits. Do men gather grapes of thorns or figs of thistles? Even so, every good tree bringeth forth good fruit, but a corrupt tree bringeth forth evil fruit. Okay, so you can tell, um, you can tell the men of the Lord by their fruits. Okay, and GMS, um, you know, of course, all right, now, I'm going to say this. Just because, you know, you put GMS in your name or you're a part of GMS doesn't mean that you're a part of the elect. Uh, we refer to ourselves as the hopeful elect. But, you know, just because uh, you, you put, you know, the label GMS or you're down with GMS doesn't mean that um, you're not a two-third over here in Babylon the Great or, you, or, you, or you're not a nigga. There's niggas all the time mixed in with the camps. All right, the Lord is uh, sifting. So a lot of the niggas is getting exposed. Um, you know, the... Uh, um, uh, what's it? Not castaways, but uh, the ill. Um, I forgot the word for it. Uh, the, the the less desirables, you know, the undesirables or something like that, whatever. But yeah, you could tell by their fruit, and um, you know, we have the best teachers that you know go that are edifying, man. Starting at the top, Apostle uh Tahar, okay, Gabar, Haramlab, you know, going down to the elders, Yashawamba. Um, Elder Manata Zakpa, the other brothers, the bishops, we get fed every day. All right, the Lord said, if you love and feed his sheep, and that's what they're doing. Um, a good tree cannot bring forth evil fruit, neither can a uh, cor corrupt tree bring forth good fruit. Every tree that bringeth not forth good fruit is hewn down and cast in the fire. Wherefore, by their fruits ye shall know them. So, hey amen. Hey, the Lord is showing you who the true men of the Lord. You can tell by their fruits. Okay, who's going in on this, uh, on um, Revelation 13, man? One of the, the, if not the most important prophecy that's um, that's uh, yet to um, happen, man. And that's going to, you know, that hour of temptation. Okay. Hey, starting um, with Elder Apostle Tahar on down, myself included, man. Second Timothy 2 and 15, study to show thyself approved unto Yahweh or unto God, a workman that needeth not to be ashamed, rightfully dividing the word of truth. And that's what GMS does, starting with Elder Apostle Heart, rightfully dividing the word and truth, breaking these down, uh, uh, the 100% truth, man, breaking the scriptures down 100% correctly. And I'm not saying this, I'm not a fanboy, uh, you know, but you got to give respect to the men of the Lord, okay? Uh, 2 Timothy 4 and 1, I charge thee therefore before God and the Lord Yahweh Shah Mashiach, who shall judge the quick and the dead of his appearing and his kingdom. Preach the word, be instant in season, out of season. Okay. Re uh, uh, um, man, starting with El Apostle Har, every week, every weekend they're camping. Uh, even, um, you know, the, the spirit quickeneth. So they, they are getting um, older in age, but they're still out there. Longer than some of us be out there standing up on their feet, man. So how much, how is that for consist, consistency? Preach the word, be instant in season, out of season, reprove, rebuke, exhort with all long suffering and doctrine. And that's what the elders and the apostles of Great Millstone do. And that's how they, um, you know, um, that's what they require from the camps or anybody that's under the banner. First Timothy 5 and uh, 17, and I'm going to end it with this. Let the elders that rule well be counted worthy of double honor, especially they who work, labor in the word and doctrine. So that's why we give double honors to our apostles, starting with Tahara on down, that, you know, and then, you know, shout out our elders and everything like that. So, yes, that's the answer to your question. Hey, El Apostle Tahara is still going strong, three, four videos a day, still feeding uh, the sheep. And rightfully dividing the word and truth, man, especially about the M-A-R-K, the Karagma, and, you know, what's to come and warning the sheep. So uh, that's it. Um, giving all honor, praises, and glory to Yahweh Ba'ashem, Yahweh Shah Ba'ashem, Chaha Kodash, the honor to the apostles and the elders of Great Millstone, and our peace, love, salutations, blessings to the Lord's elect. Shalom.